Okay, here I am going to talk to you about uh, the Lakers game today. It was sad. It was really sad. I just not could not believe that the Lakers lost so badly. Uh, Phil Jackson is a great coach and uh, Kobe uh, is a great player. However, they just did not make it this time around. Uh, Dallas Mavericks were phenomenal. They came out to win each and every game, regardless of whether it was on their home court. Uh, I think that the Lakers really uh, took this series for granted and did not understand that these guys on uh, the Dallas team were hungry and never have won a ring like Dirk uh, meant to this team that they were going to win at all costs. So with that said, uh, game after game, uh, they gained momentum. Their fans came out and gave them the encouragement and support that they needed to win. And they came out to play and they came out to win. Uh, Jason Terry and Dirk and other players, I mean, just I, the, playing against the championship team just really uh, made them uh, stars to look at in the near future. I would say for the Lakers team, losing Phil Jackson after this uh, season, um, I don't know who's going to be coaching, maybe the assistant coach uh, that's on there now, I forget his name but there really should be some trades and some heavy fines for those uh, players like uh, Bynum and Odom taking those cheap shots at uh, the players, Dallas players, and the whiskey in particular. Um, that kind of basketball, that's really um, sore loser and it's not something that you want to show young kids when you are playing professional uh, sports and that's not something that you want to go down in history that you were poor losers so with that said um, I'd like to just end that by saying that we'll be watching all the other series um, in Atlanta I'm the bedroom analyst saying goodbye